a space of nearly 150,000 square feet on two floors with just over 300 automobiles. The cars are significant, the cars are very unusual, the cars are many times one-off cars. But the bigger deal here is that we've created a space that does things like recreate a Packard dealership from the 1930s, recreate the Cucamonga service station from California, the western end of Route 66. We have really a, a, an interesting bit of history of the automobile, which really means a history of America from 1900 to 2000. Prior to 41, every car was so distinctive. Now, here we are, 2015, and the lines of every car are almost identical. It's very hard to tell one manufacturer's car from the other. Whereas prior to 1946, every car was different. And as you see uh, in our museum here, it's a classic example of that. So now take it one step further. Uh, now we've got this collection of masks. We have this amazing historic space created. Uh, now we make it available to corporate clients, to private groups, to charity groups who can now come in and use the space for their events. There is only one space like this in all of Chicago, and I would say very few, a handful, around the country even, that are of this magnitude and in complete authenticity. People are just blown away when they walk in the front door. They make that first turn down the hallway and are just shocked at the, at the size and, and, uh, and really stunning beauty of, of all this rolling sculpture that's in the building. Business folks love it, their clients are stunned and amazed by it, and so it makes for a one-of-a-kind special event.